The National City Council Committee will move forward with its investigation of Councilmember Leanna, uh, Leanna Cumber, who is running for mayor. She and fellow Republican Daniel Davis have been attacking each other over their involvement in the attempted JEA sale. Council Committee is looking to see if Cumber withheld information when she was questioned by Council. News for Jack's reporter Jim Pickett was there. And Jim, tell us what went down. Well, since this was the first meeting, they basically laid out the ground rules of what they're going to be doing. But, you know, what had happened is what we had learned, that it's unusual for a city council member to be investigated by other city council members. A city attorney was basically telling the committee what he was saying was, you know, you can do this, but it may not be a very good idea at this point. Now, many have said that this is all political, as you had mentioned, since we have that campaign for mayor. And they're really wondering what's going on. This is a four-member committee. Two of them are big supporters of Daniel Davis, including the chairman, Roy Diamond. So I asked him about that. This is about finding the truth. I, I wish there wasn't a mayor's race involved in this because this would be so easy for the public to understand that we're just trying to validate, you know, the investigation that we did into JEA originally. We need to make sure that members of our council are honest with investigations in the future. Now, Cumber wasn't there, and it's clear she's not going to show up. Now, this committee, well, they're going to write a letter asking her to appear, though they know she's not going to do that. They do have the right. They could possibly subpoena her, but it doesn't sound like that's going to happen. But we got to wait and see exactly what's going to gather on with that. And once they get this information that they learned today, well, they probably are going to turn this over to the State Ethics Commission. What would happen to it from there? Well, nobody knows at this point. And one member on the on that committee today said they should just start with that and just do that and keep the council out of this. We're going to have more coming up tonight at 6 of what's going to happen, reaction to this committee, and what's next. For now, we're live on the South Bank. Jim Pigott, Channel 4, The Local Station.